In this video, I'm going to show you an easy text review effects in Premiere 10. Keep watching! Hi everyone, this is Chloe from Wondershare Filmora here to empower your inner video creator. Have you ever seen the text revealing effects led by a subject when moving across the frame? It's actually one of the most common text revealing effects while editing. It's also not that hard to create this in Premiere 10 with the masking feature in a little bit different way. First, make sure the video clips we're using is clear with the subject moving from across the frame. We need three video tracks in order to create this effect. So I'm going to click on this icon on the top left of the timeline panel to add two more video tracks. I'm going to drag and drop this clip onto the first video track of the timeline. Copy and paste the video clip onto the third video track. Align the video clips to each other. When the clips are ready, I'm going to find the spot where I want the text review to start from, move the playhead to here, and make a cut on the clip from the third video track. Then I'm going to add a title from the top left title window. Let's choose this one from the plain text section. Double click on the title clip. I'm going to type for more intent here. Adjust the text position. Let's align the end of the title to the end of the clips too. After this, I'm going to apply the image mask to the latter half of the top video clip. Go to the utility section under effects and find image mask. Drag and drop it onto the latter half of the top video clip. Before going into image mask settings, let's make more cuts on the top letter clip, frame by frame, starting from the first cut I made. By doing this step, we are getting ready for the adjustment of masks in each small clip. Alright, let's stop the cut here when the subject is on the other side. Double click on each of the small clips on the top video track. Scroll down from the top left setting window and find the mask settings. As the subject is moving from side to side, I'm going to match the mask's X axis setting, which is also the reviewed text portion, with the subject's movement in each small clip. Starting from the first clip, the X axis number changes to a smaller number in each clip on the right. Okay, let's check out the final look. That's not bad. What do you think? There we go. That's how we can create the text reveal effects in Firmware 10. Do you have your own method to create this effects in Firmware 10? Let us know. We want to learn from you too. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe for the new videos on the channel. Keep creating and see you next time. It's also not that hard. It's also not that hard.